Oh, crab. I'm sorry. Was I supposed to grab a ticket? You think yourself above the law! But the law is not so easily outwitted! By its strength alone do we rise above the beasts! I'm really sorry. I'll go to the back of the line, okay? <laughs> you should be so lucky! I'll have your head like I have these other worthless law breakers! You can't outrun the law forever, kid. You notice, but your guards are going nuts out there. Oh, Clontre, little hermit. <laughs> Our minds are clear as crystal now. Oh, Shuck. I once thought my duchy quite beautiful, you know. Worth preserving. But compared to the reefs, it's a shameful, transient thing destined to wash away. I am having them tear it down. I thought my beauty worth preserving too. But of course my worthless life will wash away as easily as any other. Almost as easily. 
Sad, polluted crabs keep coming to this place. I thought I made it clear. There's nothing for you here. Has your sense of self-preservation rotted away, even? Or perhaps you truly wish for death? Well, I'll gladly oblige you, my friend. Square up, devil! I shall see you to the drain! <laughs> ah! 
I'll break you apart! Respect for this grove. Club. Seems like I'm still out of practice. All skills fade the time, I suppose. I truly thought I would perish in a cooler way, though. Fighting at least 10 or 12 guys. Well, you've earned that petite crab. Come, and put my tortured soul to rest. I'm not... trying... to kill you! Oh. Thought you could just scuttle in here?
The world these days is dark and mean. Even the water tastes unclean. And even those you love and trust would rip your limbs off if they must. Like Mr. R, the one in charge, who scrapped our homes to build his barge. But don't be gloomy, glum, or sad. Cause down in here, it's not so bad. Save crying for another day. Forget it all. Come on, let's play. Time for a makeover! I don't even know what this one does! Well, that wasn't as bad as I thought. No one even showed up to stop us. I don't like it. Something smells about all this. Roland knew we were gonna show up, so where's all the resistance? It all really stinks of... A trap? Right you are, bottom feeder. See, us civilized folk have rules. As much as I dislike your little modeled crew, it wouldn't be gentlemanlike to have you disposed of without a good reason. But all y'all have just stepped onto my private property without permission. And where I come from, that's a crime called trespassing. I presume you know what we do to trespassers at Shellfish Corp. Inkerton, kill the city folk. Gladly. Huh. <laughs> 
And as for you... Send you down the drain myself, you little flatworm! It's just business, kid! Remarkable work, Vagabond. The barge is ours. All that remains is to... What the show was that? Stupid, stupid, stupid little bottom feeders. Don't let any of these trespassers leave, boys. Oh, so... Sorry, my love is false. Y'all just don't know when to quit, do you? You could have all stayed in your cozy little homes in the reef, watched a shellfish corp dug up this treasure, and waited for that newfound wealth to benefit everyone in town. But y'all just had to get greedy. You decided you deserve this treasure more than the fine people of New Carcinia. And I would be remiss as a local business leader if I didn't punish y'all for this little indiscretion. I dare say that not a single one of y'all... Uh, shut up! I, I, I've been working my butt off trying to get my old life back! I'm pretty sure I've been working harder than anyone else! And now all of a sudden, I'm the jerk for wanting the treasure I earned? And you... Don't have to do anything at all! Y you just sit around and... and stuff just happens for you! It's not... fair! It's all a bunch of gullshit! I'm sick of it! I'm... gonna... get... that... Krill, wait! TREASURE! <laughs> Hold on to something, y'all! You're certain we're going the right way? How should I know? Think I spend my weekends here, do you? Well, then what the shuck am I still paying you for? Matter of fact, we're in this mess cause you couldn't defeat a damn lobster! Good for nothing, I should have left you on the seabed where I found you, you little... You. 
<laughs> Enjoying the spoils, are you, lad? Proud of what you've done? Uh, look, man, I don't want anything from you. Please just leave me alone. I don't want to fight anymore. Please leave me alone. I don't want to fight anymore. But fight ye did. Just like me. Just like old Linkerton. And down here we've both drifted. Two worthless sinners. Right where we belong. The bottom of the train! Lousy little limp! Together, lad. This is you.
By God! This is it! This is it, Krill! They all told me it was just a legend! Those buffoons! The perfect world! Do you know what this means, child? The archaeological community will never be the same, I say! With the proper funding, perhaps we can begin to learn the secrets of the ancient hermits. And then it's only a matter of time before... Oh, God damn it! Drivel! Titan! Oh my God! He's... He's dead! You killed him! Time, he says. The old idiot. Time is something we have none of. We're already much too late. Tides upon tides upon tides too late. This ocean was eaten up before I was even an egg. What? Why, why did you do that? He didn't do anything wrong! We are beyond saving. Soon we'll share the same fate as the old ocean. The world has only one use now. To punish this ugly world. To rip it asunder. You think you can wield it? In your complacent claws, it's no better than a rock. And you're no better than them. No better than the ones who ate this world up. To think. We really thought you could be our shell. I could vomit. You are not Kitan. How can you stand it? How can you sleep? How can you even breathe? You've seen how this ocean's been maimed. The agony it's in. The future that was stolen from us. You've seen everything we wanted you to see! So where is your anger? Where is your rage? Doesn't this pain boil you inside, little crab? Doesn't it just make you want to shocking scream? Yeah. Hey. 
there, pal. No hard feelings about our little disagreement earlier, right? My new powers are crazy. I just moved this whole island directly over New Carcinia. Looks like Trash Day came early. Pretty cool, right? Firth, I really need that shell. Titan's hurt bad. I'll tell you who's hurt bad. The economy. That's who. With Roland gone and Scuttleport out of commission, our whole city's gonna completely collapse. And not only that, folks are starting to say the trash we've been using is physically harmful to us. Who would have thought? But it's all gonna be okay. Now that I'm the god of this ocean, I've got a super genius three-step plan to save everyone. Step one, sink Trash Island onto New Carcinia, eliminating the whole concept of Trash Day. A permanent economic boom. What's better than that? You're going to cover this city in trash? Can we just talk about this? I just need to borrow the world for Step a minute. Step two, use that trash to usher New Carcinia into a second golden age. You'll see technology advance beyond your wildest dreams. You're not listening to me. And step three. With all that new tech, we'll form a plan to make New Carcinia's economy more sustainable. We ought to be able to start using 20% less trash within the next 200 tides or so. You thought I forgot about that part, didn't you? But I'm a caring guy. If you dump more trash on the reef, aren't they just gonna get gonked faster? And, and, and I still need to save Chitin. So give me that shell. I'm not going to let you do this. That's the cool part about being a god. I don't need you to let me do anything. It's just gonna happen. But here you are, resorting to physical violence to take down an honest business crap. No need to get angry, pal. You're only gonna get yourself hurt. I'm not! I... I am getting angry, aren't I? I think maybe... I've been angry the whole time. Ever since I left the tide pool. I never wanted to be. Everyone else seems angry all the time. I didn't want to be like that, but I can't help it. Not when people like you always get everything you want and other people get hurt for it. It's not fair. And I'm really strong now, strong enough to stop you from making things worse. You really are quite white, you know? If you're gonna fight me, quit the sob story and just do it. I've got an empire to build here. Come on, do it! Hit me! Don't be a coward! Come on, come on, come on, come on! I had
so long! Why haven't I won yet? No, 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 Krill, wait! Don't put that on! I think I get what Kite meant now! Krill, hold on! Let's talk about this like adults! If I'm gonna be angry, I might as well use it for something good! So that maybe, one day, other people won't have to fight like me! And what better way to start than to beat up a selfish, greedy, muscle... Shocker! Like! Yeah! Wait, 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 wait! What word comes to mind when you think of the Earth? This world is resilient, but not endlessly so. As this Earth spins ever faster towards its uncertain future, all will face that future in their own way. Some will fight for the world they dream of, blade in hand, some will spend their whole lives saving others from falling through the cracks. And others still will never rest in one place for long. As this fragile world begins to fracture, no matter how large or small, the one thing no creature can afford is complacency. But though history talks of warriors and heroes, and great mighty crabs that shook the world. It is the thankless deeds that shall ever make that world worth fighting for. When we first met, I'd hoped you might clean up the mess I made. And with some time and rubbing alcohol, the stains on me might fade. But nothing ever washes out.